Congratulations. I can't believe you got that on air. And he said, I can't believe it got on either. And I called Tyrell. I called Braverman. And Braverman was like, man, there's major pressure getting put on because I don't want to get into it with you now. And then I learned more from other people uh, since then. And, and, and now, because the congressman shot his mouth off, Cohen, I know some of the behind the scenes, guys in suits breaking into things, uh, things being stolen and threats. And uh, so Homeland Security went directly to Time Warner and they've just decided shut the whole thing down. Uh, so we kept wondering how this get on air. It, the, the decision in certain quarters were made. I'll oh, let Ventura do it. You know, no one will believe it. It'll, it'll see. They know that people are waking up. So they know the market's so big. The establishment's answer is, OK, let them go ahead and talk about it. We have the power. They'll never wake up. But go ahead and cover it. And then the show got top ratings on Wednesday nights. So they moved it to Fridays, hoping it would hurt the ratings. That's the dead zone. Still got great ratings. And now they're just killing it. And uh, I'll be surprised if the show comes back next year. Or if it does, it's going to be, and I don't think Ventura will do it, chubacabras and flying saucers. And I know Ventura is going to be like, I'm not doing it. No. I'm, you know, it, I, I've talked to him. You've heard him on air a few weeks ago, last interview he did before uh, he left the country in the, in the winter to go surfing down in Mexico. And uh, he just said, well, if they don't want it on. Alex, if they don't want it on, that's the way it is. I did my best. So, I mean, I've done my best. But we put something real on TV, and you're not going to be seeing it anymore. Because this country isn't as free as we thought. Or call straight ahead, stay with us. If you own a septic system or if you're facing costly septic system replacement, this message is for you. When you want to stop paying for pump outs and avoid backups, when you've had enough of the foul odors and costly repairs, use BioSafe One Septic Solution. Now there's an easy to use 100% guaranteed answer to all your septic system problems. BioSafe One Septic Solution. BioSafe One is patented and made specifically for all septic systems and made by the same team of scientists to help clean up the Exxon Valdez oil spill. BioSafe One decontaminates and removes sludge, stops costly pump outs and repairs and remove septic system stench all with a 100 percent success rate see what gives biosafe one septic solution the advantage over any other septic product at biosafe one.com that's b-i-o-s-a-f-e-o-n-e.com biosafe one.com or call toll free 1-866-424-6663 that's 1-866-424-6663 biosafe one the guaranteed bio-friendly money-saving way to clean your septic system they help to create a new world order. We are part of a new world order. A new world order based upon collective action. Invisible Empire is a damning indictment of the globalists through their own words and documents. The new world order really is a tool for addressing a new world of possibilities. It means all the world under their control. The United Nations would take over America. The Trilateral Commission would control the world. Invisible Empire chronicles how men of power and influence have worked in stealth for centuries to establish an oppressive world government. I believe, first of all, that we now need nothing short of a world constitution for the global financial system. Global governance with the establishment of the G20. So it's going to be an inner ruling elite and then everyone else. And I got news for you. You're everyone else. Invisible Empire. Secure your copy today at Infowars.com or PrisonPlanet.com or watch it online in the highest quality at PrisonPlanet.tv This is not a drill. Repeat, this is not a drill. Gun sales are on a staggering pace. Gun prices are going through the roof and that means desperate, vicious criminals now want your guns and will do anything to get them. Now, a new book reveals powerful secrets for hiding your guns from thieves and looters. You'll learn step-by-step -step battle-hardened techniques, where to hide your guns so criminals will never find them, how to create the perfect hiding place, as well as the places you should never hide your guns under any circumstance. These and other closely guarded gun caching secrets are guaranteed to keep your weapons safe and out of sight when the going gets tough. But listen, listen up. Listen For security up. reasons, the Hide Your Guns book and even the website may disappear without warning at any time. Go to HideYourGuns.com. That's HideYourGuns.com. Or call 877-327-0365. Before they come for your guns. HideYourGuns.com right now. Right, right now. now. Right now. 
Go solar for cheap. Want to use solar power, but the price is too high? Now you can build your own solar panels for less than $200 at 123CheapSolar.com. Don't laugh. We've sold over 45,000 solar do-it-yourself kits. Watch the step-by-step -step videos that even non-handyman types can use. We offer a 60-day money-back guarantee. Go to 123CheapSolar.com or call 800-713-0486. 800-713-0486. Reduce your foreign oil dependency when you go green with 123CheapSolar.com. We the people grow cotton, weave fabric, engrave ink, embed strips and fibers to protect from counterfeit, and carding to a private bank, having it led back at interest, forcing taxes to service debt. This capitalism, or was Jefferson correct when stating a central bank issuing the public currency is a greater menace to the liberties of the people than a standing army? Hi, Ted Anderson. I'm placing a silver dollar in a book explains our monetary system. Call for your copy, 800-686-2237. It's time to understand the system. Call 800-686-2237. That's 800-686-2237. The Genesis Communications Radio Network proudly presents The Alex Jones Show Because there's a war on for your mind in Kansas. Thank you for holding, sir. You're on the air worldwide on 111 or 11111. So 111111. <laughs> Go ahead. You're on the air. Alex, um, it's funny how this guy, Chip Berlay, uh, attacks uh, us and uh, people in the truth movement. Um, it's interesting. He cites uh, the Southern Poverty Law Center and he, all, he goes on to say that, oh, it's partly anti-Semitic, but the, and he's citing uh, the, uh, the defamation center, or whatever, and they they point out to Ayn Rand, who's Jewish. So which is it? Is it that they're with Ayn Rand or that? No, they're, see, uh, the psychology they're... is even more sophisticated. The Southern Poverty Law Center has been caught not just infiltrating, but heading up Elohim City, where McVeigh was at, and others. And so what happens is. They inject uh, anti-Semitism that, oh, everything is anti-Semitism to the point of people getting sick of hearing about it and then actually putting the idea into people's heads. And then Jews get persecuted and then that makes Jews give even more money to the ADL or Southern Poverty Law Center, ADL especially, that's their model. Uh, and so, again, it's basic psychology. And the globalists know psychology. That's why they're so hard to beat. But being aware of the tricks uh, is how it operates. But basically, you don't like government health care. You don't like the private federal reserve. You don't like people trying to take your guns and private property. You are a Nazi. Uh, or you hate black people. And it's just cold-bloodedly used as a political weapon. And then people politically correctly just go, okay, I'll do whatever you say. I'll keep my mouth shut. Please don't call me racist. But the good news is people are sick of hearing about it. They're tired of it. They see through it. Uh, and then the government goes out and funds the more radical white supremacist groups and others to make them look extremely crazy and dangerous so that there can then be calls for more restrictions on free speech. I mean, they figured this out. I mean, just like the government had Hal Turner running around calling for violence for more than a decade. And he was a protege along with uh, Fox News host Sean Hannity. Uh, and it turned out he was the highest level national security asset. Uh, but uh, really good points, Jonathan. Anything else? Yes. Also, notice how Chip Berlay, um, yeah, Amy Goodman keeps asking that it's asking him if he has evidence and keeps speculating, which is interesting considering that he's uh, theorizing of a right-wing conspiracy while attacking conspiracy theorists. Well, I mean, David Icke is anything but right-wing. I mean, he goes to Africa with medicine men and sits there in like long dances and rituals crying his eyes out. I mean, let me tell you, David Icke's effective because you can you believe all of what he says or 95 percent or none of it, but the guy is for real. He really believes what he's saying. Believe me, uh, you know, uh, award-winning, uh, Oscar-winning best actors can't, I mean, I've seen videos of Ike just bawling, you know, uh, when he's, how much he loves the African uh, people. 
uh, and you know all the rest of it. I mean, I mean, he, if, if, if anything, he's a real bleeding heart, and they're calling him a far right wing guy. Uh, I mean, it's just it's 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 asinine. I appreciate your call, Jonathan. Uh, Joey in Jersey, you're on the air. Hey, hey, buddy. How are you? I'm good. All right, I got a question here. I want your opinion on this. With the SPLC coming out and blaming David, David Icke first, rather with me, I would take see you and him down first, like with Alex Jones and with uh, David Icke. Why would they push him more under the bus first rather than yourself? Because the way I would look at it, like I would go and attack you first before David Icke with him talking about the reptilian race and everything. And it's just really confusing, and you have to take a step back. Well, I think that... Uh... I think that uh, Potok was saying that because he could make a connection to Ike because the guy talked about uh, conscious dreaming, uh, which I guess Ike has talked about some, but so have a lot of other people. So I think that's why uh, – and, and, and the guy talked about the individual against the world, which a lot of you know crazies have, not just people that are into liberty – uh, and so they were trying to make whatever connections they could. I mean, I instantly, before the media even picked up on it, I said, didn't Palin put crosshairs on districts? And I t tend to remember Arizona being one of the big ones. And sure, you know, we put that in our article. We said, will the media go with this? And sure enough, they were. by the time we got an, our article out, they were doing the same thing. But, but we were just looking at who would they blame. So it was whoever they could make tenuous connections to. This sheriff is in a lot of trouble because he had nothing to link Limbaugh. I mean, Limbaugh's pretty milk toast. He's certainly not calling for violence. Uh, so it's just like Oklahoma City when they blame Limbaugh. I mean, they're basically blaming anybody and everybody they don't like. We're on the march. The Empire's on the run. Alex Jones and the GCN Radio Network. Alex told you the government announced recently that the recession is over. It ended on June of 2009. The millions of Americans unable to find work might not agree. Perhaps the recession ended for the bankers and government employees, but for the rest of us, things seem to be getting worse. Gold and silver haven't heard the news either. They've begun their long-expected journey to the moon. In addition to converting your shrinking dollars into gold and silver, you should consider a food savings account from eFoods Direct. They both make fabulous investments. Food is our greatest dependency, and we know it will be more precious than any financial resource. You and your family need food to survive a crisis, and you can't eat paper, stocks, or metals. Alex has been urging you to invest in delicious, easy-fix meals to enjoy now or save for long term. This will freeze the cost of your food while you can still afford it. Visit eFoodsDirect.com on the Internet or call 800-409-5633. That's eFoodsDirect.com or 800-409-5633. This is Alex Jones with five good reasons you should consider buying a solar power generator. Number one, new climate legislation could easily double or triple your electric bill. Number two, our new energy czar wants to control how much power your electric company allows you to have. It's true. Total government control of electricity in the name of smart grid technology is coming. Number three, in some areas of the country, the power grid is dangerously overloaded. And now new socialist legislation is only compounding the problem. Number four, dangerous weather is always a threat to local grids. Every year, thousands of families lose their power from weather-related outages. Number five, a solar power generator provides powerful backup insurance and peace of mind. Folks, I really believe in the solar power generators offered by Solutions from Science, one of my oldest sponsors. You can get more information at www.mysolarbackup.com. That's mysolarbackup.com. Remember, the government...